Game 7, Canucks hosting the Oilers, and the Oilers are minus 140 on the money line. The Canucks are plus 116. The over-under is 5.5 goals. The Oilers laying a goal and a half on the puck line are plus 180, meaning if you bet them that way, they must win by two or more. And the Canucks getting a goal and a half on the puck line are minus 225, meaning if you bet them that way and they win this game outright, you win. They lose by one, you win. It's supposed to be Skinner and Silovs. Neither goaltender has been confirmed. And maybe the couple games off, Skinner actually remembered how to play goaltender, but I really don't know if he's going to be able to put two performances like that together back-to-back. Head-to-head, the home team's on a three-game winning streak. The home team is 6-4. and four. The Canucks are 7-3. and three. The underdog is 7-3 and three on the money line. The underdog getting a goal and a half on the puck line is 9-1. and one. There have been six one-goal games in their last 10 meetings. The over is 5-3-2, and two, and the over 5.5 goals is 7-3. and three. Game 6 was the only game that the favorite has won by multiple goals when they've played against each other. Game 1, the Canucks took 5-4. to four. Game 2, the Oilers won 4-3 to three in overtime. Game 4, the Canucks won 4-3. Uh, to three. Uh, Forgive me, that was Game 3. Game 4, the Oilers won 3-2. to two. Game 5, the Canucks won 3-2. to two. And then Game 6, the Oilers handily beat them 5-1. to one. That's the only game that really hasn't been competitive. I just want to say that they rallied probably behind Skinner so they didn't get embarrassed at home. I do think the Oilers are going to get eliminated, though. I'm going to take the Canucks with the money line. I'm going to take the Canucks getting the goals, and I'm going to go over. I do think that it would be way more exciting to see the Oilers play the Stars versus the Canucks play the Stars, but I just think that the Canucks play the Oilers too well, and you can't trust Skinner to have back-to-back games like that. These are just my picks. If you disagree, please go with your gut, and please bet responsibly.